Welcome to Lounge TV. I'm Larry, and there's Tom behind the camera. Say hi, Tom. As usual. Hello. <laughs> Guys, we're doing, I'm going to open for some fan mail because it's not a whole lot. Um, and we want to go and show you, and Tom has a little news for you guys. But before that, um, by the way, whoever sent the package for Kevin, uh, he will get it. Just that he's been really, really busy with different stuff right now. So as soon as he comes here, he'll get that. It'll just stay over. So I got some other stuff to give him anyway when he gets here. Uh, but anyway, we're going to open these real quick. So this is from Timmy. Timmy from Twitter. That's what it says. Timmy from Twitter. Hmm. And Timmy. I think both of these are from Timmy. Whoa. I didn't bring the other. I brought the scissors. I thought it'd be easier. You know? Yeah, instead of the tool designed specifically to do this exact thing. Yeah. Jeez. Timmy. 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 You got carried away with the tape there, buddy. Alright, so let's see what we got here. It's blue. Ooh. What is this? Wrap snacks. Original gangster barbecue cheddar. Snoop Dogg barbecue Snoop cheddar. Snoop Dogg flavored chips. Guaranteed to get you high. I mean, for the munchies, I guess, right? I guess. That's pretty awesome. Is this a is this a note or? I didn't even know Snoop Dogg had his own snacks. I didn't know that. Did you? No, but I can't say I'm surprised. No, right? Kind of just does anything and everything. Yeah. Now this one was postage due. I think this might be the first thing I've ever gotten that was postage due. Honestly, I didn't even know that was a thing anymore. Yeah, but yeah, I'm surprised that they just don't send it back because I mean, it's, it doesn't make any sense because it's like suppose I would have accepted it. Right? The, the post office wouldn't get any money, you know? Right. And it was twelve forty-five. Whatever it is, it better be good. Yeah, it's not ticking, so that's a good sign. And this, I, I believe, is from also from Timmy from Twitter. Yep, it is Twitter. Or Timmy on Twitter. All right, let's see what we got here. I should... You know what? I should look at the label. It's got a piece of tape stuck in to see see who it was actually for. You know, who was it actually for? Lounge TV. Oh, that's me and you, Tom. That it is. Lounge TV. Paper, just we've always wanted. Oh, little Debbie's. A package of little Debbie's. Man, Timmy really is goes over. Timmy goes a little overboard with the uh, Ooh, with the tape, don't he? I'm not exactly sure what the heck this is because I've had lots of little Debbie's in my lifetime, but I've never. Must be a regional. I've never even seen that. Star Crunch? Star Crunch. Cookies with caramel and crisp rice. Rice. Hmm. So, caramel and rice crispy treats? They basically? look kind of interesting. Uh, hmm. Like somebody... I mean, they're from... ...ate a bunch of kernels of corn where it didn't pop and then pooped it out. Huh? I mean, you didn't have to say that. <laughs> Thank you, Timmy. I mean, I'm looking forward to trying them. Just make sure there's no note or nothing in there. Okay, so... Interesting uh, snacks. Yeah. I am interested to see what those Little Debbie's are, because almost everything I've ever had from Little Debbie's is good, so... But anyway, let's get into the main thing now. We're going to go outside. That it's, we are. It's a little chilly out today. A little bit. A little bit. Here, you go out first. I'll close the door. All right. Let me put my phone down here because it's too heavy in my pocket. So, you want to say the big news? You want me to hold the camera? You big news? Uh, yeah, sure, I'll say it. Okay. Probably better camera work anyway. What? That's just rude. Don't look so sad, Tom. 
I'm not sad. I'm upset at you because how could you say that? How could you say that? Anyway. Anyway. Okay. I don't even know if your foot even showed up there, but it did. I saw it. Okay. I I don't know if that's good or not. Anyway, point is, uh, I am planning on getting myself a new car. What? Yep. Tom is getting a new car. Yes. <laughs> what kind are you looking at, Tom? So I'm looking at. I want to get a hybrid. That much is like absolute. I was looking at a Honda Accord, like a Honda Accord hybrid before. Mm-hmm. I'm not. Excuse the bus going by right now, guys. Yeah. I'm not 100% on that. It, what was that? 100%? It's called emphasis. It's called talking. Do you do that? I do, but I talk correctly. Most of the time. As I say, yeah, right. <laughs> Occasionally. So, long story short, I want to get a new car. Looking at a Honda Accord Hybrid. Not fully sold on it. Going to do a little bit more looking. I'll figure that out. I want to set a deadline for that a few months from now. But I also want to, at that point, get rid of my car. Yeah, and that will lead us up to the next step. Yeah. So, you know, the the thing is, Tom, you're really looking at a hybrid, right? Isn't that what you really want, a hybrid? Yeah. Okay. Um, whether it's a Honda or or something else, you're looking for a hybrid. So yeah, anyway, like that's, the, that's a big... So his car isn't worth a whole lot, guys. He's got, how many miles you got on there? 160,000, something like that? It's something like that. I haven't um, checked recently. Has brand new front brake line. We know that because we put it on. Yeah. Um, his paint job is terrible. And we're going to try to just shine it up a little bit. Uh, yeah, if it weren't for the paint. I want you to look head, head on because I did one of those headlights. Yeah, I, I can actually tell. Yeah, so that's what this video is going to be about excuse me for burping just thing guys i don't know if the camera caught it or not it probably did gross but uh i've said what i said excuse me still gross so anyway his his as you can see is really really bad yeah that's really bad and i've seen so many different videos where they tell you how you can do this you know clean them and they made them look like they're brand new this does not look brand new by any any definition any definition of the imagination but i saw this one it was toothpaste so that's what i'm going that's what i did this with it's just some crest toothpaste ah one so, of those like two dozen tubes we've got in the closet yeah because we get them every time we go to the dentist right and we don't use them because <laughs> we just bring our toothpaste anyway yeah, when because, we go on well, vacation my, my favorite toothpaste is uh sensodyne and tom's is crest but i didn't want to use tom's big tube of it up when i knew we had all these little ones so exactly so anyway so i saw the video and I, when i did see the video i was like wow it came out really crystal clear so um when i did that one i'm like yeah something something's fishy about it but anyway so what they did is they just put some toothpaste on here right they took a, a rag and then and this takes a lot of elbow grease guys i imagine it would I mean, it makes sense. You figure toothpaste removes stains from teeth. Yeah. So I'm only going to do half of it right now because it's just a show. Because if I did the whole thing, it's going to take me forever. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't doubt that, like, it's also, like, stained on the inside of the... I, you know what? That's what I was thinking. I was well. like, if I could get this thing off, and I'm sure I could. I don't know, though, because some of them are sealed units. Um, you can actually, um, if I could do that, I think it would clear it up a lot better because it does, in fact, look like on that one, especially that it's some of it's on the inside, you know? Yeah. I mean, you figure this car was, uh, what model is it, 06? Uh, yeah. Yeah, so, hey, anybody out there looking for an 06 cheap car, because Tom's not expecting to get a whole lot out of it. What do you think you're going to get out of this, Tom? Because somebody's uh, going to have to paint it. Yeah. Um... Well, let's see. I think it's worth about $500 myself. Well, it's a Lounge TV brand name. I'm sure that we could probably it runs, bump it up a little it bit. It runs, <laughs> nah, yeah, but I mean, like, you, you would settle for $500 if somebody wanted to buy it, wouldn't you? Yeah, maybe like six. What? Well, it's an 06 Ultima. Oh, so you just want to stick with the letter, or number six? Yeah, why not? Um, yeah, I had bought some sandpaper, some uh, 2000 grit wet sandpaper to try to to get this off, but then I came out here and I noticed it's all the way down to the metal. Yeah. Uh, you keep all the sand in the world ain't gonna make that look good. It needs a new paint job. Yeah, so, which 
like the the way that the paint job looks is really non-indicative of what it actually is like the car runs well like yeah and it starts up good we like just replaced the battery a couple years ago he's got uh it's got ac even if it does still have a little bit of flour in it yeah i don't know where that came from but hmm, i wonder but yeah so it's got like it heats up really well it's not like slow to heat up or cool down it's either got some power to it too the power windows still work except the driver's side one uh for some reason if you set the auto on it yeah it likes to come back over it comes back up jump. halfway yeah <laughs> Just don't have your head out there when you hit that button. Yeah. Well, or no, I mean, wait, does it do that when it closes or when it opens, or both? I don't remember. So if anybody's interested, anybody's local, because we ain't shipping it nowhere. So yeah, really. If anybody's interested in this car, you know, hit us up on Twitter. You got some toothpaste on your jacket. Oh. Well, that's, brushing that's your teeth. paint. Oh, that's paint? When I paint into the fence over there, Tom, by yeah. myself. Well, it's the same color as the toothpaste. Okay, so, all right, so, I did half of it, now I gotta get some water. Or water, depending on how you call it. What are you backing up for? Get a better shot. Can you tell the difference? I mean, this this still looks almost just like that, but... I think because it's wet, you can't tell that much of a difference yeah. right now. So I'm gonna, just like on the uh, on the video that I watched, they did it twice. And soon my car will be minty fresh. Just like my fingers. <laughs> yes. All right, I'm gonna put that over there, and then I'm gonna do the same thing again. This is fun. Not Looks no, like it. No, not in the least bit. What do you mean? I still got to do the other half of this. Oh, that's true. I noticed your backlights, you know, they're pretty good. So this is because we always park here and the sun's over here. Yeah, which is kind of odd that that's how that works, but... Yeah, the sun is not your uh, plastic's friend. Or paint. Well, if it weren't for, uh, oh, hold on. What? No, truck. Oh. Anyway, if it weren't for our atmosphere, the sun would be nobody's friend. Huh? If it weren't for our atmosphere, the sun would be nobody's friend. I don't even know what that means. It means that it would... We'd all be dead, wouldn't we? Yeah, yeah. there'd be no life on Earth. Weather is still bizarre right now, guys. We get a day like... Today is high at like 50, but you know, cloudy and stuff, or 54 I think it's supposed to go up to. Tomorrow, almost near 60. Thursday, uh, high of 49 or 50. And then Friday, I think 60 something. Then Saturday is supposed to be 76 or something like that. And then it's dropped down in the 50s again. Well, sounds like spring. Crazy stuff, man. All right, so now I'm gonna squirt this off again. You can definitely see a difference. I mean, like you can see yellowish tint on that side and not as yellow on that side. Right? Can't you? Uh, now this one maybe more it, yellow. it's different. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> For some reason, this one looks more yellow. Maybe it wants its teeth brushed again. So anyway, so now, oh man, Whew. that one was like super glued on there. So I'm going to do this other side, and then after I get done, we'll put the camera back on, and we'll let you guys be the judge. Is it worth it or not? Here I go again. Scrub, scrub, scrub. It really is like brushing your teeth, isn't it? Yeah. Well, more like scrubbing your teeth. Oh, what do you think the bristles are doing? Just scrubbing. 
Yeah, and the way I saw the guy on the video, he was like going this way. I've been trying to mimic what he did. He went this way. And he went this way. But you can even see, like, you can see where it's drying right here. How when it dries, it's more like a film afterwards. Yeah. Now, he didn't say anything about letting it sit on there. Maybe that's... Maybe that's part of it? Maybe it is, I don't know. Because I'm not letting it sit on there. So, let's see if it makes a difference. Now on that side, I also put wax on it too afterwards. Ah. Whoa. air in the hose. I think it definitely made a difference, right? Same thing with this one. This one is clear because I mean, you stand over here, you couldn't even see through that thing earlier. No, not at all. Yeah, so it definitely made a difference. So I'm going to put this last coat on here of this and then I'm going to put some wax on it and then be done with it. Sounds like a plan. My dad, when we were kids, he used to say, and anytime I brush my teeth now, I still hear it from when I was a kid. Isn't that unbelievable? My dad used to go brush a brush a brush a huh. when it was time to brush our teeth. He was a, he was very much always on our back about because kids in general do not like brushing their teeth. Yeah. Yeah. He was always on our back about brushing our teeth though. Brush a brush a brush a. It's funny the memories you have when you were a kid. Some people don't have any memories of when they were kids, though. Yeah. Which is strange to me because it's like, I remember so much stuff. I remember stuff I shouldn't remember and don't remember the stuff I should remember. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah. What's that supposed to mean? I'm saying that my memory's trash and that's usually how it works. Yeah, I definitely think that makes a difference, guys. I would agree. Now Tom's gonna drive anywhere and everybody's gonna be like, I smell something mini. Yeah, you flash my hydrogen. Tom's gonna put like, his ah, head. Oh, minty fresh. Tom's gonna put it, yeah, put his head out the window. That's me, guys, and then have that little ding. A little gleam. All right, so now I'm gonna let it dry and then I'm gonna put some wax on that. And we are done. So, uh, I have to say, what do you think, Tom? Definitely looks like it works. Yeah. Well, guys, I hope you liked this video. So if you're, don't neglect your, your, uh, don't your be headlights. like me. Don't neglect your car. Tom hasn't watched this thing, but maybe once or twice the whole time he's had this. Um, Unfortunately true. Now he didn't get it until he uh, graduated. Was it after you graduated? Uh, I got it after I graduated high school, but not my first year of college. So that would have been your second. So that would have been what? Roughly how long ago? <laughs> yeah, 14 years. You've had this for 14 years. No, that, that can't be right. That can't be right. 14 yeah. years ago, I was 14. I was yeah. 13. Yeah. Uh, wow. Uh, Jeez, Tom. I graduated college 10 years, or graduated high school 10 years ago. So it's been about nine years. No, it hasn't. Yeah, I graduated high school oh, 10 years ago. you're 28 now. Yeah. Or you're going to be 28. Going to be 28. He's going to be 28. So 27, he got it when he was 19. Roughly. So eight years he's had this car and he's washed it twice, guys. That's a no-no. You have to put protection on your car. You need to wax it every now and then to put a nice protective coat on it, Tom. Anyway, don't be like Tom. Don't be a Tom. I already said that. Yeah. Um, I think it's a definitely, you know, something that if your your windows or your windows, if your uh, if your headlights are a little yellow, try toothpaste, guys. I, it actually does work. It might not get these perfect, but it's a lot better than they were. So. Until next time, grab yourself something cold to drink or warm, depending on the day, and we will meet you at the lounge.